Hey, we're back. We're back again. Here we go. Here we go. Let the party begin. Just joking. Hey, extension from the last video. Each week, three CSD exams. I'm going to put it up on the screen because I think people have been asking for that. Makes more sense, right? You see the question. I'm going to read you three questions. You answer it and you put it in the comment section. Okay? Now, something called surgical map and I want you to uh, look at that question break it down. Do you know everything there is about that question, terminology-wise? Each answer, each option, right? Just don't know the answer and try to memorize it. Do you understand why it is? So anyways, we're going to jump right into that first question, put it up on the screen. Bacteria can be reduced in the operating room by A, aeration overnight, B, damp dusting of surfaces each morning, C, reducing air exchange in the room. Or D, maintaining humidity levels above 70%. So look at that question. Look at the answers. You probably know it. Go ahead and put it in the comment section. And we're going to move on to question two. Question two is, which of the following items is used for sponging around the spinal cord? Right? Is it A, cottonoids? B, gauze sponges? Is it C, peanut dissectors? Or D, laparotomy sponges, All right? Look at that question, break it down. Do you know what the specialty is? Do you know the difference between a peanut or a cottonoid? All right, eliminate some options. Go ahead and put it in the comment sections if you know, right? I'll leave it up on the screen. One, two, three, it's gone. On to the next question. We're gonna make these videos as short as possible, right? Each week, three questions. Stay to the end. And I'll give you a bonus one. Let's see if you can stay. Anyways, third question. When a herniated is strangulated, and sound good, when a herniated is strangulated, which of the following instrument sets is added to a general abdominal setup? Is it A, rectal? Is it B, vascular? Is it C, common duct? Or is it D, gastrointestinal? All right, look at that question. Surgically map it. Do you understand what a hernia is? Do you know what a strangulated hernia is, right? Go ahead and put your answers in that comments, right? Hey, you stuck around for that bonus question. Now, we will have it each week, three CST questions. Quickly go through these, right? Keep these videos short. So if you're interested in certain type of questions, go ahead and put it in the comments sections about what type of specialty you're looking for, what type of questions, right? For example, sterile processing, is it more anatomy questions? So go ahead and let me know, right? All right, you stuck around. You're probably about 2% of the people. Now, hopefully you guys stuck around for that bonus question. Bonus question is, and I'll put it up on the screen, which of the following catheters is most commonly used to perform an embolectomy? Is it A, a Robinson catheter? Is it B, a Fogarty, or is it Fogarty? A C, Melcott, or D, Angiocath, right? Look at that question. Surgically map it. Do you know what an embolectomy is, right? It's important. Start there. All right, put your answers in that comment section, and I'll see you guys next week. Get three more questions next week. And if you're interested, there's a video right there about sterile processing. Pretty cool video. It breaks it down for CST exams. And don't forget to subscribe with my little face there, okay? Otherwise, I'll see you next week.